just a flare off. Um, so I have been to both the Super Mario movie and the Dungeons and Dragons movie, and I can confirm that they, I loved the Dungeons and Dragons movie. I loved it so much. I thought it was lovely. I thought the cast had amazing chemistry, and I thought that the writing was really good. The Mario movie, on the other hand, um, the soundtrack was kind of lame. Not the score, like the soundtrack they used like AHA and Holding Out for a Hero. I also kind of thought that there seemed to be a lack of communication between the sound design team and the visuals team, which was kind of unfortunate. There's only one female character and she's not really like that girl boss. They kind of try and force like the whole of feminism onto Princess Peach and they don't give her like any meaningful friendships or relationships and it's just she seems like she's just carrying a burden i don't know it's it's so weird and and i'm totally overlooking the fact that it's it's just a kids movie um and maybe that's why i like the dungeons and dragons movie better because it wasn't a kids movie that's not my taste you know kids movies aren't my taste i am reading the book wait i'm reading this book it's called uh my Gosh Holmes. it's by kareem abdul jabbar and in a warehouse and to be honest with you it just feels like kareem wanted to write a book and anna also wanted to write a book and they didn't care what the book was and they didn't care what it was really like doing there's so much like lack of research in this book things that could just so easily be googled and they just haven't been um and I don't think that the book sold very well because it's only available in hardcover, which means it never made the paperback publishing. And yeah, overall it just like is not great. But I'm only a third of the way through it, so I guess we'll find out. Joe, I would like to ask you, what is your favorite dinosaur? And have you ever bought like dinosaur memorabilia with your adult money? 